Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you for stopping by. I hope that you do subscribe, hit the notification bell, make sure you turn on all notifications. That way you will get updated when I upload my content, which is Wednesdays and Saturdays at 9 a.m. Just wanted to give a shout out. I'm kind of in relaxed mode right now, but I did want to highlight, show you my cute little shirt. Uh, this is a shirt that a friend of mine we went to nursing school together, started our very first job together 19, almost 20 years ago, and we've kept in touch ever since. Hi, Fran. Great lady. She does missions trips. Oh my gosh, I think she's maybe done five or six at this point and goes to Uganda to help raise money. She prints off these shirts, bought a few of them from her, but this one's really special because this is a heart and it's actually love in several different languages, which is really really cool and I think that kind of message right now we need to spread love more than ever not that we haven't before but you know with everything going on so I just wanted to give a shout out to her and the change she's making in people's lives and her mission and doing these missions trips I think it's awesome I'm so happy to support you and support what you're doing so just want to give that shout out real quick thanks so gonna go ahead and get started with today's video gonna be just another laid-back kind of video I wanted to highlight some of my favorite highlighters ha <laughs> oh well that was Bad. Sorry. I have seven of my favorite highlighters for right now. No certain order. They're just ones that I love. Either the brightness and shine that they give, intensity, some of them color. You know, there's a little color, color variances between the ones, but these are the ones that I tend to always go back to and I know they're not going to disappoint. So one of them I'm going to highlight here is Becca, and I know this one has been around a while. It's not as popular these days, but I did want to give a shout out to it. This one I have here is Champagne Pop, and I love that it came in this little mini, and that's perfect for me because I mean I've had it for several months, and I'm never going to go through all this. The thing I like about it is it has kind of a pinkish tone, kind of a peachy pink. I don't know if you can see that there, but it's a really pretty color there. I think it's just been around for a while, so it's not that they're underrated. They're just not talked about very much anymore. More. So I do enjoy that one, but again, that's kind of more for a specific book, so I don't reach for that one as much, but I do enjoy Becca and the Becca highlighters. I would check them out if you haven't already. Another one I have here, which is somewhat of a more affordable brand. I still think they're a little bit overpriced for being drugstore per se. This is Pixie by Petra, and this is the Glowy Gossamer Duo. The one thing I do like about this is that you are getting the two highlighters in one, so you have more of one of a champagne color. And actually, it's kind of funny putting that near that Becca one. It's actually pretty similar <laughs> to that one. So, hmm, makes you wonder why I like it. That is those two there. You can see those, but I just like that sheen and I like an intense highlighter that doesn't emphasize texture, that's not glittery, not really chunky. I like a smooth, intense highlighter. That does the job for me, so I really like that one. So a more affordable one that I enjoy just for those more natural days. It's very affordable, very natural looking. This is the Essence Pure Nude, and I know this has been talked about quite frequently. I'm sure almost everybody has this one. Very affordable, very easily accessible to most people and so I really like that one. I'm horrible at swatching guys. I'm sorry. I keep forgetting that by the time I look at you you can't even see my swatches because of the angle but this one is that one here and just a very natural highlight if you can see that. I'll just put a picture of the swatches at the end. But definitely another one that I enjoy for the price. I think it's well worth the value. So one that kind of surprised me, I just bought on a whim. I was buying something else by their company and they were running a sale so I decided to pick this up as well. Uh, this is the Juvia's Place, the Tribe Highlighter Volume 3. And this is actually the lightest one they have. Of course, this is a black owned beauty brand. I love supporting black owned beauty brands though. Just brands I love in general. Did want to just highlight this one and again this is a very pretty kind of a champagne but even maybe a little bit lighter that is that one there if you can see that there very very pretty but again it doesn't emphasize texture it's very smooth and it actually is very blinding once you put it on the face I was very pleasantly surprised so thank you Juvia's Place I enjoyed that one 
All right, so this one is a more expensive one. I'm just gonna highlight this one, but it is the Hourglass Ambient Absolute Strobe Light. Now, I don't know if they have this exact one, but they have different ones they come out with all the time. But this one's nice, a little bit more subtle. I like that it has different colors. Again, you have the three and one. So depending on if you wanna do them separately, if you end up wanting to put them all together. Sorry, I'm gonna put this one in a little bit different place because I have highlighter everywhere. So again, you can get a different color depending on how you mix them. So those are there. So this last swatch I did there is all three of them together. I think that's just a nice highlighter. Definitely enjoy that one. So I gotta wipe that off. <laughs> Losing arm space. I'll just input some swatches at the end there so you can see those a little bit better. Now, one of my favorites, again, I do like all of these, but I'm really, really enjoying the Persona highlighters. And this one, the Cali Glow, I have the Laguna and I have the Zuma, and they're both very, very pretty. Laguna is lighter, of course, Zuma is darker. Laguna and then Zuma. Those are both very pretty. Surprisingly, I was afraid the Zuma was gonna be too dark, but it's beautiful. And it looks really good on my skin tone. Now, again, I keep forgetting I've gotta put these where you can actually see them. I'm really horrible about swatches, guys, I'm sorry. Hopefully you can see those there. But of course, the lighter ones, Laguna, darker ones, Zuma. Those are just so pretty. They're smooth. They're blinding like I like them <laughs> I really really have been enjoying those and I actually only got this more recently maybe in the last couple of months definitely like this all right and the last ones I have here to highlight are Ofra Ofra probably has one of the best highlighter formulas I have a couple here I have one this is called all of the lights and the thing I like about this is if you can see there it has four different highlighters in one which I think is so cool and you can buy all these separately I don't know if this one's still available all four in one but each of these are available on their own I think blissful is in here pillow talk rodeo drive and star island so we have all four of those and I know those are all available so I'm just gonna do kind of a swatch of all of them together just to kind of give you an idea it's so pretty I'm like oh I love that and then the other thing I have here again just same Ofra just a cute little palette I like when they offer the smaller size like this but this one is the signature palette this one has Star Island Rodeo Drive Bali Pillow Talk and Blissful and some of these are the same as they have in that four-in-one but I like that these are all individual and again I'd already had this but I liked the formula so got another one these are beautiful I'll do a quick swatch of these individually Oops, I'm watch, I'm watch off that old swatch <laughs> Sorry. I will try. I'll just go along in the order that I told you originally down the arm so that you can see what these look like and how pretty they are separately but then just imagine like all of them blended together how pretty that would be. Hopefully you can see that but they're just so pretty. Just so smooth and just you know intense. Love that. My favorite kind of highlighter. So guys, that's all I have for you today. I just wanted to go over some highlighters that I've been enjoying over the last few months. Some of those, like I said, are newly discovered. Some of my favorites between eyeshadow palettes and highlighters, I have way too many, but I do love a good highlighter. So if you guys are loving any of these same products, if you have any recommendations, please put some comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell, give this a like thumbs up and come back for more. Again, if you turn on all notifications, it'll give you automatic alerts when I upload my videos, which is Wednesdays and Saturdays at 9 a.m. So stay tuned for those. Otherwise, stay healthy, stay safe, stay hydrated. Until next time, I will see you soon. Bye. I'm just gonna highlight this one, but they do come in different. This is, which I love supporting black owned beauty, just, you know, any 